What is good all my dudes out there? It's your boy Roxal and welcome to Entity Room. So I know this as a short horror game that I found on Itch.io. You gotta feed the entity that is in some sort of a room that is, uh, basically all I know. All right, let's get into this. Before we get started on this video, y'all know what time it is. Time to spin this fucking wheel. Yeah! Push and punch. Haven't had this one in a hot minute. I also got myself a new cup. This one's smaller, so it's better for shorter videos. Tiny cup. Nice. <laughs> so what is W Energy? W Energy is this awesome drink mix company that got all sorts of great powdered drink mixes, shaker cups, merch, all sorts of great stuff. They released this flavor called Big Energy Tears as a part of declaring their war on Big Energy. It's their blue raspberry flavor and currently my favorite flavor on the entire roster. Very highly recommend it. They are doing a limited edition sale of new shaker cups. This one right here. And once this sells out, they are not going to be selling it again. So get yourself one while you got yourself a shot. They recently hit two years of existence as a company. And as celebration, they released a new shaker cup, their Panda Shaker Cup, and a brand new flavor called Calio Cream, which is an orange mango cream flavor and is being recognized as the best flavor that they have ever created completely blowing every other flavor out of the water. So I can't wait to try that and I highly encourage that you go and try it for yourself. They're still doing this sale as far as I know where for every one of these cups sold, they will plant a tree on our behalf. And a reminder, if you use the code ROCKSALT, R-O-X-A-L-T at checkout, you get 10% off your entire order. W.GG, check them out. They are fucking awesome. Game day, February 18th, 1987. First day at the new section. I hope everything goes well. Huh. Okay. Can I leave? No, I can't. Nope. F to use flashlight. I don't need that. Mm -hmm. Nothing yet. I know that we gotta go downstairs. Uh, that's... I really don't know a whole lot about, like, what the deal is with this stuff. There still is no interaction allowed, so I'm trying to figure this out. I still don't really need the flashlight. What does that say? Does that not look like text? So there's an open door. I could go down there, or I could go over here. Um, I am not seeing much in the way of... Oh, it is clipping through. <laughs> yeah, this, this was made very quickly, wasn't it? It's fine. Let's see if it can spook me. All right. Flammable. Yeah, I'm gonna need you to not do that. Okay. Okay, I guess I'm stuck down here. Alright, uh, let's go over here. Or, I don't know, this... Can I... E to use door. Okay, so I'm gonna go over here then. Nope. 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 I can't use it. Uh, is that spaghetti? I don't know what that is. Somebody thrust a spaghetti. There's something in there. <laughs> All right, let's go into this door. I don't know if this is gonna have a uh, battery, but it's okay. Hello? Hello? Toilet? Desk. I cannot open any of these, I don't think. Um, a locker. It's probably going to be some sort of a hiding function. Alright, let's use this computer. Email. Matt. Hello, my name is Matt. I was assigned to take care of onboarding you. So, your job is actually pretty easy. The entity needs to be fed once a day with exactly one prisoner. To do that, just open the door R1 in through your computer. After it is eaten, the respective room needs to be cleaned. Open the door, R1 out, through your computer. You need a strong stomach, but you get used to it. First, throw the body parts, if there are any left, into the container. Then clean the blood with them up. Best regards, Matt. Alright, Matt seems like a nice guy, I guess. This is an automatic email, do not reply. Description of entity 014. Highly dangerous, of terrestrial origin. Bipedal, uncanny, human-like appearance. Skin doesn't reflect light. 
glowing red eyes. Body mass consists mostly of human meat. Develops more human-like appearance over time. Doesn't kill prey before eating. Oh. Extremely agile. Can jump far distances. Incidents. Uh, April 8th, 1984. Total power failure resulting in E014 escaping the room and killing the operator. Uh, that would be August 17th, 1986. Redacted. Disclaimer, by partaking in this operation, you agree that the Entity Research Facility, also known as ERF, Earth, will not be held responsible for any form of physical harm. I'm gonna get fed at the end of this game. Alright, CCTV. Entity room. That scared me and it didn't even do anything. Hall. Operator room. There are no cameras. Room three. Hello there. Can I just leave this on? Hello. Room one. Oh. Yeah, let's put that dude out of his misery. R1 in. Open it. Can I see? Huh. Alright, doors, uh, so that one is open. Can I see the room now? Eh, not too bad. Doesn't look like there is anything in there, so I will open R1 out. Alright, there we go. I'm assuming this is where the first serious jump scare is going to end up happening. Um, alright. E, pick up. I don't know what this is. Uh, E, pick up. This looks like it could be intestines. Don't know. Uh, pick this one up. Is this a foot? Mmm, feet. Alright. E to pick up the mop. E to clean. And now it's done. Alright, put it back. All right, let's go. Do I need to close the door? I have to do it with the computer, I'm assuming. All right, it's okay. All right, doors. Close one on out. There we go. Now let's check out the cameras. Room one, night vision. All clean, completely empty. We good? Room two. This guy's kill, just kill. Yeah, that's what's gonna happen to him. Unless he's already dead. Just kind of laying there. And room three. Also, just kind of chilling. Any room. Still don't get to see it. Alright. Uh, so. Emails. Good job. Hey, good job. Looks like you're a natural. Have you checked the CCTV? Nowadays, they even have a night vision mode. Pretty heckin' cool if you ask me. Oh, by the way, in case you were wondering, while the entity is eating, the CCTV is taken offline. We don't want our operators to be disturbed. Anyway, you're done for the day. You can go to sleep already if you want. Tomorrow will be pretty similar. Feed the entity, clean the room, rinse and repeat. Kind regards, Matt. Alright, that's cool. So I'm gonna just kind of lay here and just let this happen. Bing bong, bing bong. Bing bong, bing bong. Alright. Yeah, I still don't really get to leave. Computer, email, from Matt. Power failure. Oh no, I'm dead. Good morning. You probably saw that the lights aren't working. Don't worry, it's basic maintenance on one of our electricity generators. It's just the lights. Everything else still works fine. Just use your flashlight. Today will be pretty similar to yesterday. Press the button RNN to open the door so that the entity can have a feast with the prisoner in room two. The entity wants breakfast. Don't let it wait. P.S. Don't forget to clean the room afterwards. Kind of regards, Matt. Matt, you are a great dude. I like you. How are you looking? You are looking still very much laying on the floor. Alright, aren't you in? Have fun, buddy. Nice. It's all messed up. This one is still there. Alright. So, doors. This one is there. Open it. Out. I'm really expecting something stupid to be happening here. Alright.
Uh, stop that. Oh boy. I'm about to die. That's not... Um, ideal. Alright, doors. Close this one. Here we go. Great work. Hey, good job again, dude. You really are a natural. I know hearing those screams can have a negative effect on your psyche, but trust me, those people we're feeding to the en entity are scum. They did unspeakable, highly immoral things to other people. They should be happy that they're allowed to contribute to this experiment. We sometimes jokingly call them organ donors. <laughs> anyway, our research on ND-014 could lead to breakthroughs, not just for military, but also medical purposes. Always keep that in mind when doing your work. P.S. You're done for the day. Kind regards, Matt. Alright. Sounds cool. Well, uh, can I take a shit? I can't take a shit. I'm gonna just shut that and go to sleep. Here's where I die. I know day three is when I die. Well, you just showed me what happened, so that's fun. Email. Day three. Hey, day three. Not that exciting now, is it? Usually that's the point where your work is becoming a boring routine. Anyway, you probably know what to do. Feed the entity, clean the room, take a shit, bust a nut, go to sleep. I'm just joking, haha. It's important to have a sense of humor working in an environment like this. Anyway, tomorrow's a new batch of tomorrow a new batch of prisoners will arrive. Fresh meat. Don't worry. They're handcuffed and our guards will bring them into their rooms. Just make sure their rooms are clean. We don't want them to be uncomfortable. Winky face. P.S. The entity room camera works again. Kind regards, Matt. Oh, that's great. <sighs> Let's find out how horrible this is. First, room one. This one is okay. Room two. This one's okay. Room three. This one is okay. Entity room. I'm fucked. Alright. Hello? Here is where things go bad. So, let's prepare for this mentally, even though we can't really do that. R3 in. Go ahead. Eat, bro. Nice. Alright, I am gonna check the cameras. Blood, as usual. Entity room is broken again. All right. <sighs> All right, time for things to go south. Oh, I forgot to open the door. Yeah, it's uh, not here. All right. Well, I know that's not going to stay the same, but we will trust. Ready? Three, two, one, jump scare. Ah. No? Hello? Stay there. It's getting suspiciously quiet. Nice. Three is a magic number. Yes, it is. It's a leg. We throwing away the body parts. Hello? And a head. Convenient that this blocks most of my view. Alright, and we will clean. Cutscene? No cutscene. Nice. So, now things go south after? Nice. All clean. Well, there's your room. Um, stay shut. South. Go south. Alright, doors. Close this one. There we go, CCTV. Entity room? That's oh, open. But there is no email again, which means time for things to go south again, south of the border. Hello? Can I turn on any of these? No, I can't. Ah, so... Can't do this. Alright. Here's where I die. Death? Hello? Oh, nice. Cell phone. Email. 
Read this. Okay. Oh shit, I'm dead. <laughs> Oh, man. I knew it was going to happen. That made it a little too obvious, but at the same time, that was a really cool concept. I'm just wondering, what could have happened if they modified that game just a little bit so instead of it ending that way and it being a guaranteed ending, they gave you that slight glimmer of hope that maybe you could get away. Overall, I really liked this game. This was a cool concept, and I feel like this could make a really cool full game if you, like, put enough time into it, you know? Thank y'all so much for watching. If you like this video, smash that like button. Subscribe to join the Legion, and I will see y'all in the next video.